Hey everyone and welcome back to another Dropified video training tutorial. In this video I'm going to show you how you can set multiple suppliers for individual products on all of your stores. So why would you do this? And while there are a bunch of different reasons why you use this, uh, one that comes to mind pretty quickly is if you have multiple suppliers and one of your suppliers runs out of stock, you can easily just manually change it over to your different supplier so that if a customer places an order, you don't have to worry about them waiting extra long shipping times for things to restock. You just send it to a different manufacturer and they get their product totally normally. So let's get started. So what we need to do is we need to go and actually find a product. Now I've already gone onto AliExpress and found a product that is exactly the same but comes from a variety of different suppliers. So I'm going to go there now. So I have this pen right here. And so this is a very distinct looking pen. It's called the Shark Pen, and it comes in a variety of colors. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add this, I'm gonna send this straight to my store. And so once that completes, we go into our products and see that it is there. So if you click on this, and you go over to connections, you can actually see right here that this is the original supplier from the original AliExpress link. So once you do this, it will automatically import and scrape the data so that you're getting this directly from the Jinhao flagship store. So say Jinhao runs out of a particular color like black or blue and you don't want customers waiting so you add a supplier by pressing right here add supplier. So this is going to open up a new link and it's going to look almost identical to this. And so what we need to do is we need to go and find a different link through AliExpress and get a different supplier. So this was the original one. And as you can see this is the original one from the Jinhao flagship store. But if we go over to here this is from Patty Stationery Shop. So if we click on this, instead of bringing this over by using the extension, we just copy and paste this listing, and we paste it here. And so you'll see Patty Stationery Shop shows up, the supplier store link shows up, and then all we have to do now is press Save Changes. So you can set the new one to the default, you can keep the other one to the default, but you can go even one step further and then go into your variance mapping and select different suppliers for each of the variants. So let me show you what I mean. So by default, uh, Patty's Stationery Shop was set as the default, so these are all the variants that we have through Patty's Stationery Shop. Then you can go in and look into the Jinhao flagship store and see all of the different variants here. But say Patty's store runs out of stock. If you go to advanced mapping, you can actually go in and choose which supplier you want to be sending products to your customers. So say black runs out and Patty's stationery shop doesn't really have an idea of when they're coming back in shop. You can change it to the default of the Jinhao flagship store. So you can actually pivot and adapt so that as inventory comes and goes, you can make sure your customers don't have to wait for restocking times. It's a really cool feature that we offer, and it's going to be really helpful to make sure that you're not adding even more time to your drop shipping orders. So then make sure when you're done to press save. And that's pretty much how you do it. So that's going to do it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, be sure to leave a thumbs up on it. If you have any further questions, uh, you can always leave a comment down below and we'll try to answer them as quickly as possible. If this video helped you out and you think it would help someone else out, feel free to send it to them. And if you never want to miss one of our uploads, you can always press subscribe and then hit the bell icon to make sure you're notified every time we publish a new video. But besides that, I've been Riley for Dropified. Have a great rest of your day.